Welcome to part 7 of Make My Newspapers tutorial series on our cloud newspaper designer. Let's jump right in as always and launch the designer from our homepage. This video is going to address how to insert templates and how to add and delete pages to your design. Inserting templates is easy to do. Over here on the left is your insert template button which I'm going to click on right now. You'll see a new menu, which is showing you the myriad types of templates that are available to you, from general to school to church, community, and so on. There are almost a thousand templates for you to use. For today, let's choose a community newspaper template. Notice that a group of four templates, all of the same theme, is displayed. Remember, our templates are inserted by the page, so you can pick or choose your templates in any manner you desire, whether or not they are from the same theme. In this group, the front page and the three inside pages are all of the same theme. So if you want to, you get automatically at least four pages that look alike in their concept. But if you wanted, you could scroll down and choose from any of our templates and adapt them as you see fit for any project. When I find a template I like, simply hit the insert button and the template will load into the designer. From there, just change the text as you see fit or replace pictures and generally change or adapt the template in any way that fits your needs. You are in complete control. When you're ready for another page, simply look up here and click on the next page you want to work on. Remember, newspapers comes in page groups of four. So if I want an eight page newspaper, just click on the add four more pages button and you see four more pages will show up. If you don't want them, click the delete last four pages and they'll disappear. Be sure there's nothing on the pages you want before you delete them. Now that I'm on page two, just go to the insert template button again, choose what template you want and insert it into page two. It's that easy. Also remember that if you change your mind and want page 2 where page 4 is, no problem. Just grab page 2 and move it over to the page 4 spot and let go. The pages will automatically adjust permanently. And that's it. Insert away and if you don't like one template, choose another and you can do that as often as you need. That's the end of part 7 of our design tutorial series. We hope it's helped and don't forget to look for other videos that might help you and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel to be notified of any new videos we might release. Happy designing everyone!